Good morning children. Welcome to Fourth Standard Social Science. Today we are going to study about municipality and corporation. Unit 3. So to know about municipalities and their duties, to understand the structure of local body, to know the functions of corporation and town panjaya and the sources of income for municipality and corporation. Why you are running? What happened? Uncle, what is municipality? Why should we pay tax? Mugila, municipality is a form of local government in a small town where 50,000 to 1 lakh people live. This is divided into several wards. Our house is in the 10th ward. In our locality, there are totally 30 wards. In Tamil Nadu, there are 148 municipalities. Who is the head of the municipality, uncle? The head of the municipality is called the chairman. One of the members of municipality is selected as vice chair person. The tenure of the member is 5 years. Uncle, what are the duties of municipalities? Mukila, they provide street lamps, constructing library and its maintenance, maintaining local market, that is called as santai, providing drinking water facilities, constructing roads, removing garbage dumps. Uncle, what is the source of income for the work done by municipality? Mugila, central government and state government provide the money. People also pay in the form of house tax, professional tax, drinking water tax, shop tax, road tax, and drainage tax. It also forms the income of municipality. The following also come under municipalities. Township, example Neyveli, Cantonment Boards, example Parangimalai, Kannur, Notify Area Committee. The local structure of uh, local bodies are, they are divided into two bodies. One is urban local bodies, under that corporation, municipality and town panjayat. Whereas in rural local bodies, it is divided as district panjayat, panjayat union, village panjayat. Amugila, for example, we can we call Chennai, Tirchi, Kovei, Madurai and Salem as corporation. Uncle, what is corporation? Certain municipalities will be declared by the government of Tamil Nadu as corporation based on their high population and high revenue. Uncle, how many corporations are there in Tamil Nadu? Mukila, in Tamil Nadu, there are 15 corporations have been established. The oldest corporation is our Chennai. So, these are the work done by the corporation members uh, removing uh, drainage waters, rain waters, and this is the Chennai Corporation main office. It is called as a ribbon building. Uncle, who is the head of the corporation? The chairperson of the corporation is called mayor. He is also called as the father of corporation. The tenure of the members of the corporation is five years. Tenure means uh, duration. How many years they are working? Okay. And the Indian Administrative Service Officers and similar rank holders are appointed by the government to the corporation. Most of them, most of the urban areas have corporation. So these are the some of the corporation, nearly 15 corporation: Chennai, Madurai, Kwayamuthu, Tiruchirappalli, Salem, Tirunelveli, Vellore, Tutukuri, Tirupur, Erode. Tanjur, Tindukal, Hozur, Nagarkoil, Avadi. Uncle, what are the duties of corporation? They constructing and maintaining the city roads, providing drinking water facilities, disposing garbage, constructing libraries and maintaining them, creating parks and maintaining them, maintaining of birth and death records. Uncle, what is the source of income to the corporation? The amount collected from the tax, 
wealth tax, entertainment tax, custom duties, road tax are the sources of income to the corporation. Uncle, what else are these beside municipality and corporations? Mugila, apart from the corporation, the municipality town panjait also exists. The tenure of the president and other members is five years. Panjait is governed by the executive officer. Town panjait function is placed places where the population exceeds 5,000 people. Uncle, I came to know the administration of municipalities and corporation very well. Thank you very much, Uncle. Mujila, good. Come, let us wash our hands and have a lunch. Children, now we are going to see about the uh, exercises. First one, fill in the blanks. First one, the oldest corporation of Tamil Nadu is Chennai. Second, the father of local self-government is Lord Ribbon. The Balwant Rai Mahada Committee recommended a three-tier Panjait Raj system in the year 1957. The tenure of municipality is five years. Second, match the following. The rural local body, Grama Panjayat. Ribbon building built by Lord Ribbon. Navyly, it is town Panjayat. Town Panjayat is more than 5,000 people. Mayor, it is related to corporation. Okay, children. Let us see the question answer. So, this is the fill in the box. And let's see the answer in short. So, what are the duties of corporation? Constructing and maintaining the rare city roads, providing drinking water, facilities, disposing garbage, constructing libraries and maintaining them, creating parks and maintaining them, maintaining of birth and death certificate. Write the structure of local bodies. The local bodies is divided into two as urban local bodies and rural local bodies. Under urban local bodies, corporation, municipal and town panjayat. Rural local body, district panjayat, panjayat union and village panjayat. What is the local number of, total number of corporation in Tamil Nadu? The total number of corporations in Tamil Nadu is 15. This is the answer, okay? What are the sources of income of municipality? Central government and state government provide the money. People also pay in the form of house rent, professional tax, drinking water, tax, shop tax, road tax and drainage tax. It also forms the income of municipality. So thank you for watching my video. Like my video and subscribe my channel. Thank you.